here we are outside the newly renovated Arts and Crafts Centre with Philly McHugh. Well, no, Philly Young, I'm sorry, aren't I? Uh, yes, and here we are. Philly did this herself and painted it all to resemble the wonderful black opal which Lightning Ridge is the centre of. Right. This is about $250 billion dollars worth of opal depicted here. Is that all? That's all. What I love about this place, you know, is that you can arrive here broke. No education. You can be a teenager. And within a month, you can be a multi-millionaire. Absolutely. Because it's the world and one of the few worlds left of true entrepreneurial spirit and hope. Still got a little bit of freedom. They are trying to take it from, away from us. Are they? Very, very old, very much so. Why are they trying to do that? Just to make us conform with the rest of the world because it's too good here. You can't do that. Oh, well, you see the governments and the politicians and we have to pay for water from the bore these days and we have to uh, go on the grids and yes. everywhere's got street signs and I think the next thing they'll try and do would be to put in a uh, set of lights. But of course the marvellous thing about and McDonald's. here... McDonald's. Uh, McDonald's, yes. The beauty about here is that everybody makes do, don't they? They do. And to get here, you can travel about 750 kilometres from Sydney and you can find interesting things on the way and similarly from Brisbane. How far is it from Brisbane? About the same. It's about the same, which is about 10 hours. The road... 14 hours to Melbourne, but yep. they all come. And the roads are all good, aren't they? All good, yes. And you can come by train to Dubbo, for example, and then bus. There's a wonderful bus service out out to here and here we are with Marley and our old friend, no she's not very old <laughs>